Hi there, this is Abhishek and in this video I will share a small trick with you related to the formatting of the data which is present in this uh, simple table chart. So once you uh, want to do some kind of formatting things like you know changing the font type and all in normal case it will going to impact the entire table. So for example if I right click on the chart go to properties and say for example if I want to change a uh, font size then maybe I'm just making a font size as 12 as compared to 8 and clicking OK. So now the entire table's font size has been changed but suppose if this is not the thing which you want and generally it is the case that we don't want the entire thing to be changed as uh, you know once with one setting like changing the font size is changing everything header column values and the respective values related to these columns so something like in in normal scenario what you want is uh, that these column values should be highlighted or should be bold so that the end user can clearly see what these values are or things like you want this background or the column uh, font type is different according to your own company policies then in that case we need to have this feature custom format cell enabled to do all of these kind of formatting so let's go back and first keep this as a default one by changing the size to 8 and now it is the same table which which was earlier and the default type also so to do that custom format cell option we need to enable the design grid so that is present in view design grid so the grid is enabled and with that if I right click again I will see this custom format cell option which was not available earlier so just to show you if I again hide or disable the design grid and right click over here I don't have the custom format cell Custom format cell is only enabled when you have enabled the design grid. So that I'm again going and enabling design grid. Now I can go in and change or do a custom formatting of the cell. So if I right click over here and do a custom format cell. So here the close is enabled. That means this entire column close, new and shift values which are there will be changed. So for example, if I want uh, not the black text color if I want something like uh, this maybe red color and so red is okay I want bold and then I click okay. Now you can see only it is impacting my column values. Now I want to change the uh, header or these call these header values which has status and total order value. Something like if I want to go again back into the custom format cell change the background color to something like dark blue and uh, change the text color to something like white so that end user is clearly see it and something like you want to do it and click ok so now my metric is is according to the formatting which i need to show it to the end user based on my company policies or how I want to show it. So that's how uh, you can quickly do a custom formatting of the cell to further enhance the formatting of your charts and data. So this is pretty much all I wanted to discuss in this video. I will meet you in the new video with a new topic.